Pornography has its pluses and its minuses. We're never going to get rid of explicit sex, nor should we. My position is that we need sex that's more meaningful, where there's a script, and it's not just two actors acting out uh, sex as like two dogs or something without any sense of what it means or who are these people or anything else. So I think in some cases individuals and couples can watch erotic pornography and get turned on and become more sexy and more imaginative in their own sex lives. But in other cases they're watching stuff that's unhealthy like incestuous themes with a stepfather or a voyeur uh, looking at somebody in a dressing room at a department store. This can get you in big trouble. It can land you in jail. So it means that you're out of balance. What I help is I help people of both sexes who are obsessed with pornography come in so they have more of a sense of balance about their sex lives, so they can masturbate without necessarily having to look at porn to do so, where they can develop their own fantasies, which is much more healthy and can, can then act as a script in their heads for real good sex with hopefully a partner, or at least with themselves.